Ciao guys and welcome back to Lampy. In today's video we are going to Fara Las Pesa. We are going shopping some Italian ingredients for a Sunday lunch that Ali is going to prepare for our friends tomorrow. Yes. And what do you think about my outfit? This is like my favorite things to put on during the summer. Something very light, especially the flowery pants here. I love all that. Favorite shoes from, you know, if I have colorful shoes, obviously. Mm -hmm. There's only one person in this world who buys me colorful shoes. Me. Ali bought me this one. Leather, very nice and comfortable. Green and yellow. And... No, please. but uh, can, you, can I have, please have your, uh, your uh, strawberry? No, no, no. There is this strawberry. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> this is the only one that is ready. And uh, it's mine because you guys, there are other two which is for Ali and Kika, but they have. You're going to be here the whole time. And this other coming, you have all the time to eat them. But yeah, but you can go strawberry picking in, uh, in Germany. 100% bio, not sprayed with any chemical. This one is 100%. Also the size, you know, okay. the one in Germans from the big fields. The, those are also commercial fields and the strawberries are almost as big as apricots. Mm -hmm. Buongiorno ragazzi, lo sapete? Noi siamo italiani e poi oggi andiamo a comprare l'abbacchio più famoso del mondo like mm. my father-in-law will put it exactly that way because if you're italian exaggeration especially when it comes to food is everything so we would say we are going to buy the most famous lamp in the world yes let's go to the shop and show you a bacio con le patate <laughs> con le patate and also with the most famous pato pato patates in, in the, the world, world. <laughs> of the universe of the Oh, did you see? Did you see? Did you see? What did you see? Yeah, wassermelon. Oh, wassermelon. You want them? How much is it? Oh, oh, one euro per kilo. No, it's uh, 99 cents uh, per, ah, per kg. Yeah. See? Is that a good price for you? And uh, for you? Uh, oh. I don't know. In August, for us, like you pay probably. 50 cents per kg. So I should wait until August? No, if you want, we can buy one. Oh, I think I can transport it back to Germany. <laughs> Just asking. We don't need to pay nothing for that. Okay. You know how much does this cost? Yeah, tell me how much does it cost. Let me just say 3 euros. And is that a lot in no, comparison to Germany? No. no! Do you know this... I don't want to say... You know this fat asparagus that we buy in the Germany that we produce in Belize, for mm -hmm. example? It costs way more than that and it's not even tasty. Who is for you, for example, the biggest uh, difference that you have in an Italian supermarket and in a German one? The differences? Mm -hmm. Things are more pricier here, in my opinion. Uh, more price, uh, it depends from what I think fruits and veggies are way cheaper than, uh, than in Germany. Well, let me put it this way here you have most of the things really, really good quality, mm -hmm. and in the German market, you have good quality, then you have like the low quality, which is the cheapest one. Which, uh, if you can't afford the good quality, then you, you, you take those. So, what is that? Pecorino with pistachio. Is that with pistachio? Huh? Yes. Mm, looks nice. And is there also the one with pepperoncino somewhere? Check this one. This one is a, spi a special cacciotta. It's a special fresh cheese that is covered in, uh, in mosto. This is a lot leftover from the grapes, like uh, the, the peels from the grapes. And uh, with the mosto, they put the cheese into it so it absorbs the flavor. 
This is another typical Italian cheese, it's provolone. Is this not cacio cavallo? No, it, it looks similar because it, it has the similar the shapes, the but uh, it's different because it's different the kind of milk they use. In cacio cavallo they use also some, uh, I think, some meat from, uh, from, some meat from the sheep. Uh, here instead it's just, uh, it's just from the cow. What are all these cakes? I have no idea, but to be honest, I never buy the cakes in this Nice. I think that is nice, the, the fruit tart. Mm -hmm. No, but I'm saying it's nice. This is also something very nice. You have a small section of just my favorite thing. Pastries. <laughs> no. Interesting here that you never never finding the German supermarket you have the aged state so you can just buy it here in the supermarket by yourself and go hook it at all amazing like there is this aged T-bone steak I don't know what that is but you know in Germany we just went to the restaurant a few days ago and we paid about 120 for this a kilo of this and this cost 50 yes and then you cook it home and then 50 is uh, it was super expensive. This is also something that you don't find. Oh Maria Salvador. This this one look like Kobe's meat. You see the quantity of the inside. Oh this nice stuff we want to La tostata. And we told everybody we're not going to have them. E quest'altra viene 8,99 Ok, allora dammi tutta la gustata gentilmente Questa? Sì C'è pure la spalla vero? Eh? C'è anche la spalla? Sì La spalla lunga questa I have also the part Va bene, of the leg Va bene, non lo tagliamo So, so unfortunately they didn't have half of the lamp They only have pieces And uh, they didn't have uh, the interior part of the lamp Which is, which we are going to need for Quartella You can try later on in another shop Hopefully you can find it, but it's rare. That was would, would have been the best place to find this kind of stuff. Okay, wait. So the the piece that we wanted, we find it except the internal organs. Yeah. Ah, okay. Solo la spalla, sì. La costata lasciano in terra, ragazzi. Ciao, grazie. 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 How much is that? This is like 30 euro, but it's... Uh, 30 euros? Together with the sausage, everything together. For me, when I come to the Italian supermarket, the excitement is always the biscuit. You don't even eat biscuits. I don't eat biscuits. When? I do you like don't buy biscuits. You don't I want to eat biscuits for breakfast. Why do you want to eat? You know it? that I love biscuits. <laughs> you know that. How many times? What are your favorite biscuits then? A mm -hmm. This is. I mean, I stop maybe eating a lot of biscuits when I'm in Germany because I maybe I don't like the kind that they have and they don't have so many variations. But when I'm in Italy or when I'm in Namibia, I make sure that I have biscuits and this. This is my favorite, and this brand here. Ambrosia. <laughs> Ambrosia, and you know, like an Italian breakfast. What is it about? Every day in the morning, you have warm, warm milk, and you dip in a biscotti, and that is breakfast all day, every single day. Let's move to the wine section. Whose favorite? We are going to show you the wine section of an Italian supermarket. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. Now you understand. <laughs> but you That's know, you know. And uh, believe me, here you will not find any wine that is product uh, outside of Italy. No kidding. Yes, like because you won't find any South African. Uh, maybe a small section if you are lucky, but uh, most, if not the totality of the wine that you can find here, are from Italy. Yes. No. Yes, can you see these are region per region? These are just from Fiuli. And also they just Tuscany. This one is from Tuscany. Those ones are from Tuscany. These are from Sardinia. 
we what are is not, your favorite? We are not taking wine. Why not? Because our friends say they are bringing wine. Even though they are on sale, we aren't taking any. Come but on, let's if, take one. If Vincenzo and Cattuccini. Now, yeah, where do we get the most amazing? Where do we get Cantuccini? Cantuccini, you can get them from here. Or also Who from wants? your favorite shop in Trevignano tomorrow morning. We go at breakfast in Trevignano. Yes, but they are the Cantuccini. When do we have Cantuccini? We have already. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Uh, we have already Canolo, baby, please. For breakfast. Oh, you no. can take Cantuccini. Cantuccini and wine for breakfast. Yes. yes. Yeah, yourself. Cantuccini and white Why not? I think you would be. I mean, yeah, no way. You can do that. No, no. you do it. Uh, mm -hmm. We are trying to have a healthy lifestyle. Anything. So I would love to buy at least one amaro, like have, one digestivo. We have water. We have water, but you know we are going to eat a lot tomorrow, and we need some liquor. And at the moment, we don't have liquor. Those are all the most typical. We have can, different kind Ooh, of grappa. We found something made of Deutschland. Ah yes, that's some from Jägermeister. Deutschland. Jägermeister. That's true. I don't really like Jägermeister, but Echt? no, no it's like not special. So we have limoncello. We have, uh, I think, that's for example, Zeta Piras. That's uh, something that I love. This is a liquor that is made in Sardinia and is made. Uh, from uh, what was the name of this plant? It's made out of myrtle. Amaro, a normal amaro rucano. Ah, no, your favorite, Nerone. And we have this with uh, with ice. It's also really nice as a cocktail. You're going to make cocktails tomorrow? No, no. It's just uh, ice with uh, with amaro. That is a really nice. Oh, but don't you want to have one of your no, favorite no, bottles no, with wine? No, no, no. If you want to Why have, not? If you want to have wine, baby, just have it. I don't want to have sweet wine. This is nice. Yeah. It's a shovel, I don't even... It's very popular. Oh. It's the sable fish. Sable fish, yes. The mackerel? Yeah. My, my favorite things, but difficult to eat. Where is Can, that? Canocchio. Canocchio. Ah. Mm -hmm. I mean, when we are in Germany, we also go to big supermarket at the fish section. But what you find here, so canocchio are this very, very difficult to eat. No, these are not canocchio, these are scampi. Ah, it's a scampi? Yes. Oh, yes, it's a scampi. And then you have the bivalves, but the bivalves are just the shell. No, scallops. Those are scallops. Yeah. Scallops is very easy yes. to eat. And, and here, you of course, the mussels. No, but you have mussels. Bongole. Bongole, these are tatuffi. And then you have. These are calamari. Calamari and tatuffi. And what is this? These are sepia. No, these are pulpi. Lobster are just filming. And granzella is like uh, the, the meal. The lobster are those. So they are. Can you see the difference in prices? In between Astice and Aragusta. That is and Granzella? Granzella. Granzella is, a, is a, the crab. Ah, and they are not in here. They are not in here, no. We are going to get a Simba. Let me go. <laughs> we just found... Uh, we found something, my favorite thing, yeah? It's already a spritz. It's afro spritz. You just need to put it in a wine glass and add a slice of orange. So I'm going to take one of these for me for tomorrow. Yes, and Crudino. Yeah! <laughs> That's really cute. Uh, nice ice cream. Uh, you feel like mm -hmm. a nice ice cream? Uh, what a nice and a bad ice cream is once you have just tested the, the nice one. Okay. But before that, I honestly thought my creamy, you know like this uh, creamy Namibian ice cream that I, I let you try last time? I thought that is the best ice cream ever in the world. It doesn't even melt under the sun. <laughs> so, no. Mama so we are back in the car. It's so hot. It's so freaking hot in the I'm car melting, at the moment. We are melting. So, <laughs> now, babe, what is the temperature at the moment? Is uh, it just melting point for people coming from Namibia? And the Italian ones are not melting. No, what? baby. 
No, we can yeah. stand much more heat. No! Okay, of course. I, I mean, we did a summer trip in Tuscany that was also very, very hot. Here we are. Bye! Ooh, yeah! My goodness! Can we? No! No! Shut. Stay tranquilo. Are you. You know, we were just eating this with this um, chips with pomodori so it's uh, chips with tomato flavored and we were talking about when we are having chips like uh, chips 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 you know chips like simba and ali is asking me what do you uh, what are you what, I do, said, you want what to know? do you like most the italian chips or the namibian simba chips do you, do you know that simba is not namibian South Africa. Yes, it's South African. So, if you're from Namibia or South Africa, you know Simba chips. Delicious, delicious, many different flavors, chutney, uh, chutney and tomato are my favorite. Vinegar and salt. Uh, uh, salt and vinegar is also very, very good. And you, you want to know if, if this is better than Simba? Like a serious question or are you just joking? I know that it's better, but I no, 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 baby. To be honest, I I don't think there is really any chips that I've tasted since I left Namibia that can compare to Simba. I think uh, you are. They even made no, babe. Simba. They made a movie out of Simba. Baby, huh? the Simba chips came after the movie. Or oh, the movie came after the Simba. No. Yes. With that, is the end of our video. We finished Fala La Spesa, we are now driving back home and we want to go to Rome in the evening. We did, we got everything we wanted. So guys, that was it from us. If you enjoy this video and you like to, Ali to make more video when he's going to be here alone this summer, leave a comment below, subscribe and most important guys, always also give us thumbs up if you enjoy our content. See you! in our next video ciao 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 bye oh but you know you're so white <laughs> you're just blending in with the thing <laughs>